In this tutorial, we will introduce you to the basic interface of Photoshop CS6. Once you have launched Photoshop CS6, the first thing that you will notice is its dark interface. If you're not happy with the dark color, you can go to the Edit menu, scroll down to Preferences, and then select the Interface option. In this new window, you will see that in the color theme there are four default colors, black, dark gray, medium gray, and light gray. There is another way to go about it. Simply press Shift and F2 to lighten the interface, or press Shift and F1 to darken the interface. You also have the option to change the color of the pasteboard around the image if you want. Just right-click on it and you can choose from the same four preset colors that were available for the interface. You can also customize the color by choosing the Select Custom Color option. It will show you the default color and then you can pick out the color you want. Now there is a new feature called HUD Feedback, which stands for Heads Up Display. You can see when we drag the picture, we get information about the distance we have moved it horizontally and vertically. Now let's use the free transform tool by pressing Ctrl and T. You will see when we scale the image, it gives us a percentage value at the top of the bar and also gives us the width and the height values to which we have increased or decreased our image. Now if we drag outside our image, then we can also see the angle at which the rotation is taking place. We can also skew our image by holding Ctrl, Alt, and Drag, and the image gets skewed in the direction we are dragging, and we get the angle of our skew, too.